Hi, everyone. Welcome to another segment of Shift Worship Tips. My name is Mariah. I'm the brand manager with Shift Worship. Uh, today, we are super excited to have you guys join us. Uh, we're going to be talking everything Easter, so how to plan your service, the media, and some throwback things for you. And, you know, we're excited about what's to come this season. Thanks, Mariah. And hey, everyone, I'm Dale Carter. And I don't know if everyone remembers this or knows this, but I used to do video blogs for Worship House Media when I worked for our sister company only, Worship House Media, and we featured a lot of shift videos. So as I was thinking about this video and talking about Easter, I realized that I found some old videos. As you can see here, here's a video blog with me and my colleague Luke talking about Shift Worship's empty Easter video from 11 years ago. So. Hey everyone, welcome to the Worship House Media offices for this week's installment of the video blog about Easter. Yeah, we know this is a really busy time for you and your church. We know that you're working hard preparing your Easter services, but we just wanted to come in and tell you some of our favorite videos that we think you definitely need to check out this season. I really like Empty by Shift Worship, which has such a unique take on an Easter video. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Have a great Easter. So, <laughs> that's a small little fun fact background for me, but we're excited about adding new Easter this year and we're excited to talk about it. So let's do it. Awesome. Well, hope you guys enjoyed that little throwback clip. Um, Luke is actually, he's really hands-on with the content that you guys see coming out each week. Um, so, you know, Luke's still around. We love him. Um, and we're grateful to have his, his keen eye over our content. Um, so if you guys are checking us out because you are ready to start planning your Easter service, it's never too early. Um, we have a couple tips that we want to share with you guys, you know, so when you are coming together with your team or church leadership, you know, and you're kind of like, how, how do I go about setting an Easter service? Um, you know, you want to make sure that you have your thoughts written down, um, any verses you want to share, uh, the main points, um, ready to go, um. And the content is kind of like the icing on the cake. It comes after, you know, you have what you want to share ready to go. Um, so when you have all that and, you know, you're in your meeting or if you're planning this by yourself, you definitely want to head over to shiftworship.com um, and browse through our Easter media. We have tons of collections, mini movies, social graphics, um, sermon bumpers. Um, yeah, tons, tons of stuff for you to for you guys to choose from that we'll um, also be sharing in this video. Um, next, uh, you you know, you, you basically want to start with a countdown, possibly this allows um, and welcomes your congregants into your service, sets the tone, um, lets them know how much longer they have until the service begins. Next, you'll want a welcome slide. So, you know, you're letting them know that they are welcomed and they're loved and we're excited to have them. And then um, you'll pick motions or still backgrounds that go with the message. Um, you can use our quick editor to dump any worship uh, lyrics on there, any verses, any main points. And then if you needed a transition from worship or from a sermon, we have many movies that you can pick from as well. Um, some are very cohesive with collections and some can stand on their own. Um, so you can throw that wherever you need a little break. Um, in your service. And then you can close out with a goodbye slide or communion or um, offering. Um, we offer those for live streams as well. And then, um, of course, we have social media graphics that you can choose from. So you can be advertising and highlighting what you're going to share all week long. Or if you wanted to recap the week after your service, you can use these as well. Um, and that creates all of your platforms, um, allows them to be cohesive with one another, um, generates excitement, um, creates engagement, and yeah. That's awesome, Mariah. I think you went over everything, so you don't need me. <laughs> Just <laughs> <laughs> uh, One thing I would like to share is, is how to use, or how to pick a pack for the multiple Sundays and um, other holy days leading up to and including Easter. So all the great things that Mariah offered come in, in most all of our collections. And the cool thing about a lot of our Easter collections is they don't just cover Easter. So we know that you're gonna need media for um, Lent and Palm Sunday and Good Friday. So there's two options 
that I always recommend to customers. Some like to do a different pack or a different look for each gathering at your church. And some like to stick with one look through the whole season. So I'm going to stick with that idea of the one look through the whole season. And I really like the Easter Risen pack by Centerline. And we're going to have more that's coming out this year that are these large or as you could call them mega packs with multiple uh, types of media that spans the whole holy season. So this pack includes a lot of mini movies um, for Good Friday and for Easter. And then on the motions and still backgrounds, the thing I love about this pack is that you can use it for your Lent services. And then leading into Palm Sunday, Good Friday, we have um, media for all of those within the one pack, which is really cool. So um, it has everything you need. And then that way you have your whole look really for the whole um, from February to March when, when April or when, when Easter comes along. And then, then you can pick mini moving. So what I like to do is broaden your, uh, your choice from the pack for the mini movie you may use on Easter because we have so many great mini movies from so many great producers. So pick your look that you're using the main pack for and then supplement it with mini movies. And um, I think you can't go wrong. And so of course, try us out for free. Uh, get the free trial if you're not a member yet. So you can download a lot of these to have ready for Easter. I wanted to share my current favorite collection um, that's out right now. It's called Horizon Crosses. Um, I like the mood and the tone that this sets. There is a mini movie included. It's currently the background that I'm using right now. Um, I just like that it displays the cross and the cross is the focal point of the hope and the sacrifice that was made by Jesus during this time. There are um, welcome slides, communion slides, um, a Good Friday slide, and then, you know, there's several different colors. So you can totally stay with one color, use all colors, um, mix and match how you want. Um, there's three different types of countdowns. There's a 10 minute, a five minute, and as well as a trivia countdown. And then there are social media graphics as well. Um, pro tip, you don't have to have your entire service be from one collection. Like Dale says, you can pick and choose from whatever is going to work best for you. And, you know, that's what we're rooting for is just you utilize and you love our media. Thanks for joining us today. And we're excited to see you guys use our Easter media. Um, and we look forward to sharing more Easter media and more shift worship tips with you guys.